farmers what's going on welcome back to another hated hey video now this video is going to be very special because i'm going to be fully mastering my score tree which means i'm going to be unlocking eight score worlds finally i am very excited so let's get started the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to harvest my crops i've got some soybeans so let's just harvest them and see what do we get so all right there we go and I need some more corn, so I'm just going to plant some more corn. Ooh, we just got a marker stink. That's very awesome. Having a look at the visitors, let's see what do they need. Some olive oil, I'm not going to give them. And Greg needs some rice. Nope, I don't have any rice, Greg. Go away. All right, so if you guys come over here to the front of my farm, close to my honey tree, this is my beautiful little squirrel garden. Honestly, I love the combination of the, these are the trails. Yeah, the trails and the peanut bushes. They look so adorable. So you can see this is my current squirrel house. Um, it's kind of a tree which has three squirrel house, which means I have six squirrels. Um, each house is two squirrels. And I've got some peanuts ready to be collected. So if I tap in here, you can see currently I've got two stars, which means I'm on second stage. And to get to the final stage, I had to collect about 270,000 pin pots. And honestly, this took a really long time. It took me almost four to five months, I'd say. Or if I count the total time, this would be um, approximately eight months. And a lot of my friends have already fully mastered their scroll tree, so I'm kind of late. The thing is, um, in the past few months, I didn't play my game a lot. I was really busy in my exams and other things going on in my life. And then secondly, also because the peanuts were really common back in June, July. So I didn't use to harvest my peanut tree, the squirrel tree at that time. But then after the December update, they kind of became rare. So I started harvesting them regular and I just started playing my game a lot. So that's why finally today we're going to be fully mastering our squirrel tree. And I'm so excited. It's always a good day when you fully master something in the game. So yeah, I'm just going to harvest my peanuts. There you go. Currently I can get about 43 peanuts from my squirrel tree. And each peanut gives me 43 XP, which is um, a cool thing. So yeah, um, and you can see I just need about... 800 more peanut pods to get to the next star and i'm very excited i'm also going to be unlocking an achievement which will be the furry friends three i might get 10 diamonds and 3000 xp so my parents are now going to get started to work and yeah here you can see that i've got six scrolls right now and once i fully master i will be getting two more and that's going to be pretty awesome so yeah it's very cool i actually love to go to other people's farms and see how does this fully mastered scroll tree looks like so let's just go to my friend's farm and see how are they doing with their scroll tree um i basically love the designs of the squirrels and the painted trees that the people can create with the help of um, the daffodils and it's very beautiful and it's a very natural design so you can see i'm here at this farm and having a look at their squirrels all right, where they put their scrolls? Um, oh, I can't find that. That's weird. Am I missing something? I, oh, there we go. Yep, that's it. Look at the beautiful natural design. So this is how your fully mastered scroll tree looks like. It's huge, but it's not as huge as your beehive tree gets. Um, it's still cool, you know. And so, yeah, it's pretty awesome. I'm very excited, you guys. So I'm just going to wait till my squirrels uh, keep collecting and i'll let you guys know my progress in a while um, i can spend diamonds if i want to do it right now you know diamonds are never exciting the best part of the game is when you wait the patience is the best thing of the game like when you wait to get new stuff it's very exciting so for those of you who are low levels or who are still getting machines i cannot tell in words how exciting it used to be when i used to unlock new, new stuff I didn't used to get sleep at night. I'm not kidding. I, I love this game and I'm basically addicted. I was addicted. I've been a fan of Haiti for a while. So yeah, I'll see you guys a few moments later. All right, I'm back. As you can see, congratulations. My scroll tree has been fully mastered. Finally, I now have three stars. I can get four scroll houses and I can get even more squirrels for my squirrel trees. It's going to be very awesome. And I'm really sorry I couldn't show you guys the pop-up screen. You know, the pop-up message when you fully master something in the game. When I was recording the video first, my phone restarted and literally everything went blank. So I was very frustrated about that. But anyways, we're just going to get into our game and see 
what's up with my new scroll tree and I'm very excited, I'm very happy, it's like one of the goals that I've completed and I have no idea why my game is taking so long to load, oh my god, recently there's been so many problems going on with Haiti, which literally drives me crazy. But anyways, we're here and you can see, oh my gosh, my next year bushes are dead, that's crazy. But have a look at my beautiful tree, you guys, it's amazing. It's big now, better than before. I love big things. Um, I think especially the decorations, they look beautiful. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna be putting some revives on my nectar bushes because they're dead and I really don't like the dead trees or bushes. I think they're just not so cool. But yeah, having a close look, you can see a lot of wood there, a lot of flowers there and it's fully mastered, um, more houses. And I think I still need to collect a few peanuts. I don't know, yep, that's 298 over 300, so. Let's just go ahead and purchase some more scrolls. So, all right, you can see six over eight, which means I need to get two more, and each one of those scrolls cost 7,000 coins, and that means I spent 14,000 coins. And the achievement unlocked as well. So, if you have unlocked Furry Friends 3, which was to have eight scrolls, so I'm just gonna claim the rewards. I got 10 diamonds and 3,000 XP, which is perfect. So also you can get a lot of diamonds and XP. So just gonna send some thank you letters there. And I feel like still some of the scrolls are working. So yeah, it looks pretty huge. And I might decorate this, like I don't know. So let's just harvest my crops. I've got some carrots and soybeans. Let's see what we get. So we got an ax and a melon. Although I don't need this, but you know, something is better than nothing. So, my style is full, and it feels like I need to sell something, but I just want to have a look at my peanut tree. That's called tree. All right, so I'm just going to be selling some. The These are the sunflowers. I have a lot of them, and I only need about 150 or something, so I'm just going to be selling them to make coins. So, crops are also a good way to make coins. You can just sell anything you have next to in your silo, so it's always good to harvest things and then sell things, especially if you're a low player, this could be very helpful for you to make coins. So I'm just gonna put some more and I'm just gonna harvest my leftover soybeans right here and let's see what I can plant now. So um, I'm just gonna plant some corn over here and all right, that's enough of the corn and let's just go with the wheat. Now, okay, so look at the squirrels, you guys. Okay, so I've just collected one more peanut. So now I have in total eight squirrels. Before I used to have six, so which means one squirrel house can only have two squirrels. Right, and now I can get even more peanuts. So I will be able to get four peanuts in every five hours, which is a great opportunity because I can make more peanut products. Um, it will be awesome. And did you guys actually notice how my squirrels just stood up and they said hello to me? That was so cute. I love to watch them. Look how they're running. They're so cute. Oh my God. It's like one of the best additions in the game. I love new animals. And I wonder what's gonna happen in the future updates. Are we gonna get something new? Maybe more peanut products would be awesome. Like ever since the peanuts became rare, now you can't get them. Oh, I hate this message. But anyways, so yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys some of the products that we can make with the peanuts. So the first product is the honey peanuts. But the thing is it only needs one peanut. So like it would be better if you get more products that need more peanuts. And then we have the peanut noodles as well. And what's the next product? Oh my gosh, I forgot. Oh yeah, it's the peanut butter jelly sandwich. That also needs one peanut. So that's only a couple of products that we can make, but I really hope in the future we get more of these products. That would be very awesome. So yeah, that was about this video. I just wanted to show you guys that I've been finally fully mastered my squirrel tree, which means I have eight squirrels and I can actually get more peanuts in every five hours. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did,